Hello, listeners. My name is Jerry Jeremy, and you're listening live to Stutz City Radio. I've been hanging around at the radio station, and I've definitely... Ice cream! Can I buy some ice cream? Buy some ice cream? Conrad, do my ears deceive me, or does this blue boy think he has to pay to taste our perfect dessert? I think your ears are perfectly sweet, pistachio. You can try for free! Just a No, no, looks like you also made it to this radio crazed city. Oh, what's this? You don't have any flower bouquets here yet? Bok and I already have four. Good luck winning the contest, just uh, Jester! Aki! Hey, uh, did I tell you that I'm a musician? Oh, what, what music do you make? Well, it's kind of hard to explain, really. Do you have a song I can listen to? Of course! If you give me some of those delicious to garden. Break up! Break up! So big, and the people are so weird. Love it. Let's start the show. We have to make a poster first, otherwise, people won't come to the show tonight. Jester, Jester, Jester. You know nothing about Bark. Hey Sok, Jester? Let's start the show. Alright, are you sure you're ready? Nice! I'll set up the chairs and I'll, I'll see you at showtime. Uh, 
I am just a humble prince and I have it all from riches to kitchens and I also have uh, the finest armor money can buy and uh, a cave full of spider webs there's nothing more I need but uh, the world would be shocked if they saw who I really was Roar, roar! I am just a mighty dragon, the youngest but strongest son of the mighty dragon senior. Fight me, prince! I will take everything you have! Taste my steel, foul beast! You can do it! You can do it! You can do it! Get him, Prince! <gasps> no! Stop! <laughs> You fool! Don't you know what I really am? I am a... Um... A three-headed dragon! <laughs> Gargle! My worst fear! Prepare to run, lizards come! Hear my roaring growl! <gasps> Gah! Get away from me! Very scary, Jeff. <laughs> I'm going to eat your entire head, dragon! Ah! Not that! You'll never catch me, beast! <laughs> eat that head! <laughs> oh, Chester, are you alright? Uh, I mean, I have fall? defeated you, uh. Hey, Prince! Salamander you man! Now I, the best dragon in history, can finally rest. What a cool show. Yeah, it feels good to perform in such a big city, right? It's so cool that we get to travel around and see more of the kingdom with this theater show of ours. I never expected to see more than Dorptown. Hey Sok. Yeah? I haven't had this much fun in a long time. It's so cool to just do whatever on stage together. I was too nervous to say it, but I feel it too. By the by, I had a new idea for a show. Something more personal than a roaring growl or statue Sok. Something, I don't know, where we tell a bit about our own lives and stories and maybe I dress up like a phoenix oh, or maybe something. I, and I could be like your best or something and then... And I could fight you? Like, yeah, like as if you're fighting your best. Oh, and then we can overcome like the differences that we... Oh, and, uh, and what about Dash Beast? Oh, and we introduce Dash Beast! <laughs> Dash Beast! Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> Rachatella, I need you to scream now! Sell ice cream! Morning, Chester. Oh, Hi, Sok. Yeah. Who's playing that beautiful music? Oh, yeah. I don't know, but it sounds like it's coming straight down from heaven. Yeah, it does sound very good. Good? It sounds like it's coming straight down from heaven. Right. Let's go check it out. Right now I have sprinkles, marshmallows, whipped cream, little cookies, caramel, smickles, a juicy pear, peanuts, cookie dough, cookie crumbs, licorice, almonds, cashew, oh say that's enough!
Shulk and Jester. Just woke up. Move now, while you have been but dreaming, Book and I have been practicing for our theater performance. It won't be long until we win the contest to perform at the Royal Palace. We'll become the number one theater act in the kingdom. That. Ooh, Book, you're right. Jester, not to be rude, but if you're still trying to win the contest, it might be an idea to just stop Book and I will win. Sook and you will lose. It's not worth the trouble. Oh, no, 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 no. Let's get every flower bouquet that city has. What a sad, sad, delicious day. You want soup? My lover, Gierigruid, murdered. Bedly Bed was the name? Yes, we have to find the one who... Listen, Miss Beth. We at Pester Control take our responsibilities and customer confidentiality very We will find this pesto and control it. Pesto? No, I want you to help me find the murderer of my husband, Mayor Gierigruid. We're on it, Miss Beth. The pesto will be controlled. J Dog Jerry Jeremy here. We are still mourning our lovely mayor, Mayor Gierigruid. This is a song to remember him by. Huck, can I ask you something? Yes? You must have a lot of stuff, right? If you have items for every crowd? Yeah? Well, where'd you get that stuff? Uh, fell off a wagon? Isn't that a... Uh... They fell off a wagon! I'm selling airplugs made out of cheese and other stuff. <laughs> Beautiful. You will be forever missed. It's a, it's a shame what happened to him. Cheese! Stick or plug! Put it in your ear! I'm selling it! Jeremy! Oh. Here is Pete Barn, part of Scotch Bob, taking over from Jimmy for a second. Next up, we have a guest here in the studio who jumps a little higher than average people. Whoa, that was pretty high. Here, live in the studio, we have a normal human male with a hoodie on, a prince, and a princess from Thurseville. Hey Sok. Hey Jester. Don't think I've forgotten about that cashmere scarf, Sok. The what? The cashmere scarf. I don't have it. Sok. Jester. Hey Sok, do you remember last Christmas? Hey Sok. Hey Jester. What will we buy once we sell the diamond? Happiness and a sense of belonging? He's right? Sok. Yes, man. Let's start the show. All right. Are you sure? Nice. I'll set up the chair. I am just a simple jester. I look around and I see uh, spider webs all around me. And behind it, there is a, uh, a heroic road. And in the distance, I can clearly see uh, a romantic sunset. Jester, you rascal! You're a simple thief! 
You're wasting away your life, hurting others in the process. It's true, I was. But now I want to better myself. You cannot change. The past will always catch up with you. I will show you that I can be reborn. As a phoenix! A phoenix? A phoenix will be able to fly in the air. Oh, uh... Make sure you don't fly too close to the sun, Chester. You. Uh, are you okay? Yeah, thanks. You've seen me transform into a phoenix. But there's still this lingering darkness in my life. Maybe there's something that can bring back the light. He's right. I will, uh... Tell a very scary story. I heard a story once, a story about Dutch Beach. Dutch Beach like was a creature so evil, so powerful, so scary, that whoever saw it has never been able to oh, really? tell anyone. I came here for this book. The only way to feast the is to slay the beast. The only way to feast is to slay the beast. <gasps> My past caught up with me. I have to reveal who I really am. I am... <laughs> Dutch beast. <laughs> ah! Don't you dare scare me unexpectedly. I'll hide behind these bushes and give him the biggest scare of his life. I have to pop out when he's not looking at me. Scare that so- ah, I am Dutch Beast! Gyozo! From thief to beast, I am finally whole. All should fear me, for I am Dutch Beast. Listeners, Jerry Jeremy here. It's the third day since the murder of our beloved Mayor Hiedekut, and still no one knows who did it. Oh, well, excuse the interruption of this broadcast, but we have a caller. Um, well, I'm, uh, the name. Selling ice cream is my game. Yeah. Ice cream. Gonna... Hey, Sok, Jester. Stealing the diamond from King Prost is going to be the best Better day. than the day we... Shh. Friends, we got a letter today! Our ice cream shop is bankrupt! Oh no! Even after all that free ice cream we gave them! Let's not lose our cones! This is a good thing! We can send a letter back and fill the envelope with sugar! And we can eat this for such you! Bring me my sprinkles! Stop it! Life isn't always wonderful and sweet, Conrad. You can't solve everything with sugar, pistachio. Ever since what happened last summer, I feel sad all the time. And that's okay. But what really makes me feel bad is that I can't talk about it with you guys. Bellily Beth? Blue Beast! How do you know my name? I might have heard your name back when it was in Dorptown. Dorptown? That reminds me of someone. Have you ever heard of Kletsmajor? Kletsmajor, he sabotaged my life. The Stad City Mayor was his crush. And took him on affairs with a ride. Kletsmajor, tried to steal my guy. He would never admit it, but it ruined my life. Jester, Hofnar, I don't want to discourage you, but we have nine well-earned flower bouquets. Impressive, isn't it? Some people are just meant to be on stage, I guess. No, no. Patat. That's my name. Hey, uh, Jester, want to listen to a song I uh, recorded? I still have to edit it and stuff. Uh, it's still nothing. Oh, yeah, sure. Um, it's 
just a demo. I still have to edit it. Mirror reflections. I'm selling. Well, mirror reflections. Get your mirror reflections. Out of the way, kid. If I even find a trace of pesto, we're gonna quarantine this whole city. Sorry, my partner is a bit obsessed though with the pesto. Why would a pesto be dangerous to the city? Why would the pesto be? <laughs> Who's there? Pinata! Pinata who? I'm going to turn you into a pinata if you don't. It's time for some self reflection. Mirror reflections! Get your mirror reflections! Listeners, have a good night, everyone, and remember, Jerry, Jerry, yeah. Okay, so Hi Jester, I want to uh, start the show. Alright, are you sure you're ready? Nice, I'll set up the chairs. All I want to do is sing this song with you Stuck inside this house that I found into I can share it with you yes. Because I am hoping I am Hofnar I am Hofnar Sok and Jester Enjoying the show? Bok and I are doing great here in Stad City Soon we'll have enough flower bouquets And we'll head to Zeehaven Harbor We wish you a good luck Bleh.
This is not good. The audience really likes their show. We can do this, Sok. Let's give them a great performance. I am Jester, and I've never been so far away from home. I look around, and to my surprise, I see a... Uh... Spooky thorns, all around me. And behind it, there is a... Uh... A musical road! And in the distance, I can clearly see... Uh... A very depressing town. Jester, you rascal! You're a simple thief! You're wasting away your life, hurting others in the process. It's true, I was! But now I want to better myself. You cannot change. The past will always catch up with you. I will show you that I can be reborn. As a phoenix! A phoenix? A phoenix will be able to fly in the air. Oh, uh... <laughs> Make sure you don't fly too close to the sun, Chester. I love this. <laughs> All right, this is epic. Yo, what? Don't fly too close to the sun. Deep. Wow. <sighs> You've seen me transform into a phoenix. But there's still this lingering darkness in my life. Maybe there's something that can bring back the light. He's right. I will, uh... Sing about my darkness. If I sing about the dark, the light might return. Wow. Sometimes on lonely afternoons, I feel the dark, I feel the gloom. And when I can't forget the past, I feel the dark, I feel regret. I'm so when the right morning now. sunshine comes, yellow birds sing happy songs. I knew it was just the night, the very thing that stopped by light. Beautiful. Now the only thing left for me to do is... Um, I have to do some deep self-reflecting. Yeah. Look everyone, I'm Jesta. <laughs> the only way to thrive is to look me into the eye. <laughs> but to get to a good end, you have to be a friend. But to see what I should be, I have to look like me. Right? <laughs> To really find yourself, you have to look like someone else. <laughs> These outfits are getting heavy. I'm losing balance. Wow. Did somebody call Dr. Drama? Nope, all good. <laughs> Once I was a thief, but then I sang a song. I've bettered myself and I can finally be happy. Hey, good morning, Chester. I have some good and bad news. Hit me. We cannot do our show tonight because they're using the stage for karaoke today. Karaoke? But the good news is that Jerry Jeremy asked us to do a performance on his radio show today. Smack doodle, that's cool. And that's not all. The princess is in Stad City. Let's go see her. Looks like pesto, smells like pesto. Tastes like him too. Eating random street goop. He's a daring man.
It breaks my heart to see him like this, Merle. I know, but soon it'll be over, princess. They'll save the kingdom and stop this curse. Princess? Chester! Sok, how's it going with the contest? Really good. We already have 15 flower bouquets in Dorptown. We're really excited to play at your royal theatrical spectacle. Oh no, 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 oh, no. But you won't be performing there, Sok. Hello, princess. My name is Hofnar. And I'm Hofjo! So, what brings you to Stad City? My family is coming into town tomorrow. King Proust and King Capril? The prince. Yeah, I'm sure he'll be happy to meet you all. Princess, I have something to discuss with you. Oh? Hey, uh, let's meet again later today. I have to go. Yeah. Yes, Princess. Thank you for the invitation. Buck and I will tell you all about how we'll be the best theater act in the kingdom. Bah. We used to be friends, you know, Gladsmajor and I. Each summer we went to Zeehaven Harbor and sneaked into the pirate ships. But when my lovely Gierigaard entered the picture, he couldn't accept it when we got married. He left and became the mayor of Dorptown. We never talked since. So this morning, Jerry Jeremy asked us to perform on his radio show. Let me know when you're ready for that. I'm ready for the show. Alright. Are you sure you're ready? Remember when we were younger and we were secretly listening to the radio together? I can't believe we're going to be performing on there now. You better believe it because we're live in... Five! Four! Three! Two! One! It sounds like a thousand little mites busting out their tiny drums just for your entertainment. Hey Jerry, we are here to... Wow! Was I spiraling again? Sorry, listeners. Won't happen again. Although, that's what I said last time. Anyway, Spook and Jester are here with us today in the studio. Their improv theater show has been all the rage here in Stout City. Thanks for having us on, Jerry. My name is Sok. Well, before we hear these two perform, let's throw some quickie, quicko questerinos. Jester, Sok, here we go. What do you think about King Pro's recent political changes concerning Turzeville and the Monsters of Wildwoods? Pretty good. Whoa, uh, no, not only do they have an amazing theater show, they also have a strong political voice. Th thanks, Jerry. We're just trying to be honest men, and uh, this is our first time on the radio, so we're trying to... Next question! So according to you, who deserves to be thrown into the prune juice? The king or the creatures from Wildwoods? Creatures, of course, Jerry. Controversial, but I love it. Oh, that, that's just the way we are. Two controversial people, not living by anyone's rules. You might even call us outcast. But, what do you think should be the main topic during the run for royals? Freedom or revolution? The run for royals should be for freedom. A free run, a front. Listeners, listen to this. He's telling the truth even if you don't like it. Well, uh, just doing our job. And you're doing a great one, son. Next, Sook and Jester will be performing an original song for us. Ooh, well, that might not have been the greatest performance ever. I think it's time to take some calls from our listeners, one-on-one. -on -one. Just you and me and our listeners and Jester and Spock. Let's take some requests from the listeners. Call us here at the studio and see if Sulk and Jester can play something just for you. Every time they get your genre right, I'll give them a special sticker. Arr! A Kraken is pulling our ship under! 
Sing it, me a king that will make me fight like dark, Captain Blackheart himself. That dragon has no choice but fall. I think of all the in the dark I heard. That was terrible. Abandon ship, ladies. Abandon. We've it, got another caller. I have always been afraid to reveal who I really loved. Lost a lot in the process. Please I lie send me awake a tune to, to make me feel love again. And wonder if you miss me. I wonder how life I could have been. I love this fun, the joy. Thank you so much. Our next caller is on. You're a businessman, right? Oh uh, yes, and uh, business is my profession. My dream is to one day open a haunted house and make In the dark I money. heard a voice, no, what is that friend. sound? What is we that noise? Push. I can't do this, I can't do that. Again, That's I am it. all That's alone good. back. So spooky. That sure convinced my ghost friend. And now it's time for our final caller. I'm useless. I'm worthless. I'm I think of all the wretched times. I tried to steal my vibes. Tears kept floating out of my eyes, like beans floating the in the sea. This beautiful seas. song in the world. I think of all the wretched times. I tried to steal my beans. Tears kept floating out of my eyes. Like beans floating in the seas I think of all the wretched time Thanks for calling in, but it looks like that's all the time that we have. I had an amazing time. What about you? Yeah. Listeners, have a good night, everyone. And remember, Jer- 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 Jeremy, Jer- 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 Well, that went well. Yeah. Hey, let's see if the princess is still around. Hey, Sok and Jester. Merle and I listen to the radio. You have real nice radio voices. Oh, uh, thank you, listeners. So, hey, Merle and I were thinking of riding the Ferris wheel. Not my idea. Wanna join? Let's go. I'll take the sock. Hey princess, look! You can see the whole city from here. Yeah, whoa! This is so exciting! Almost as high as the towers of the royal palace. It must be so cool to be a princess. Well, lately it's not so great. Oh, what's wrong? My family, the curse... Ugh, there's just a lot on my mind lately. Curse? Did I say curse? I, I mean oysters. No, you said curse. No, I said oysters. Sometimes I wonder if I'm doing the right thing. It's hard to find the good in yourself. The good in yourself? I believe there is something good in all of us. Everyone has their role to play someday. now, Chester. So, what's your story? Well, Sok and I have been goofing around all our lives in Dorptown, but we weren't really going anywhere. I've always felt stuck, like something was missing. All this time, I've been searching, now I've longed for something new. All this time, I've been searching. I've been dreaming, I've been looking, I've been waiting, I've been searching, I've been dreaming, I've been looking, I've been waiting, I've been searching, oh I've longed for something new. I believe there is something good in all of us. 
Or something. Oh, okay. <laughs>